I was with somebody that I did not really like. I think I was in it for the wrong reasons and he was just a total bodybuilding bro and I think I already knew deep down that he wasn't good for me. I'm not going to say his name because I don't even want to give him the time of day because this guy actually ended up single-handedly ruining and destroying some friendships that I had with some of my closest guy friends. That's fine. Like I was cheated on by somebody who already gave me so many red flags. Where are all the single men between the ages of 35 and 45? who are also seeking a relationship. Where are y'all hanging out? I used to have a boyfriend who owned a lot of property across like Surrey, Hampshire and London. Some of them were rented out, some were Airbnbs and some of them were just empty property. And under the bed, I found some pink blankets and a pink hot water bottle. So I took them to him and I was like, who the frick are these pink things? And why are they in your house? He said, well, um, I'm actually gonna sell this house and I thought it looked like a bit of a lads pad. So I just wanted to make it a bit more feminine. So I borrowed some stuff from my mum to put out for viewings. Maybe I'm dumb, but that is the most believable lie anyone has ever told me. Long story short, it actually turned out that they did belong to another woman, and he actually had two other girlfriends, two other entire lives. I was the third, so they were there first, and those two girls both lived in other properties that he owned. A true man, a real man, they don't wait to be asked. They may hear that you have an appointment and they may just offer you a credit card or give you a wage recurringly. If you are a woman and you are in a relationship with a man that has no money and cannot provide for you fully, and I mean everything you need, such as a house, money to live on, and basically everything you need to be provided for as a woman, everything you need to be provided for as a woman, hair, makeup, shopping, then you are dating the wrong man. You should only date a man who can fully provide for you. Stop the cap. 